Welcome back to Picture Healer Channel. This is Shi Tian. We are going to look at the July's Flying Star Feng Shui combination chart today. For July 2021, the month starts from Xiao Shu, the small summer or small heat. That's on July 7th until August 7th, start of fall or Li Chou from the 24 solar turns. During this month, there is one more solar turn called Da Shu or Big Summer. That's when weather starts getting really hot and it's on June 22nd. And on the right is the Flying Star Monthly Chart for July 2021. If you have my Feng Shui calendar for the 2021 Year of the Ox, there's a little mistake on the chart. I have two of the number six on the chart. And the northeast should be number three, not number six. I'm sorry about the mistake. Now back to this chart, we have number nine in the center. In the month of June, it's number one star in the center. And that is very lucky because all three stars in the center are very lucky stars. And in July, it happens again. The number nine is a very auspicious star. It's a star of festive events and a prosperity. Just from the center star, we can see basically this is a good month, continuing from the good luck in the month of June. For general residents, the first thing you should check is the direction of your main entrance. And the second one is your bedroom. Those two affect your luck most. And you can just overlay this chart on top of your house using the direction on the compass or just generally you can look at the Google map chart. On the top is the north. And this is the combination chart including the period 8 chart in the bottom and I put the yearly chart on the upper left. And as usual, we will start from the center and go clockwise to look at all nine different sectors. In the center, we have number nine star as monthly star. So we have six, eight, and nine, three very lucky stars here. So they represent good fortune, money luck, helpful people, talent, fame, and prosperity. And the number nine fire star generates number eight earth star. So that also means money luck. And number eight star generates number six metal star. It is also about money luck and fame. So again, the center is the best location in this month's chart. You can place important rooms here or place money enhancers here or just spend more time in the center of your house. The next direction is west. The monthly star is number two. If you study flying star, you should know number two is the illness star. And both two and five are more negative stars. But the yearly star and the period A stars here are very lucky, number eight and number one. So it's not too bad. And the 2-1 combination is the uh, earth controlling the water. And this indicates the females overpowering the male. And that can mean disharmony between mother and the son. So this combination is generally not good for male. And the 2 and 8 combination indicates good wealth luck or success in business. And the 8 and 1 combination, both are lucky stars. And it's also about increased money luck, intelligence, and fame. And because we have a number 2 star here, so it's better to place some type of metal objects to reduce the power of the number 2 illness star. And you can use a bronze bell, wind chime, or anything made of metal. And also try to avoid construction here this month. In the northwest, we have number one as the monthly star. The first combination is one and seven. The seven is the metal that's controlling number one water star. 
So this is not a lucky combination. It can mean the loss of money or relationship trouble. And the one and nine star combination is also a controlling cycle. The water controls the fire. Even though the number nine star is a happy and festive star, and this is generally a lucky combination, indicating money luck and happy events. But because of the water fire conflict, that means it can have some unexpected changes. It can be unexpected money loss or injury. And the number nine star is a fire star, and also controls the number seven. The metal star, and it can also mean loss of money or relationship issues, and you can reduce fire element here, such as red color or triangle shape or sharp objects, to balance the seven and nine stars and reduce possible issues. The next section is North. It has number five monthly star. And again, you probably know the number five, the Wu Huang, or the five yellow is not a lucky star. It can mean all kinds of misfortune or accident. And here we have two and five together in the north, so that's really a sign of illness and accident. So be very careful if your main entrance or bedroom is in the north this month. And the best solution is to place the metal objects as a feng shui cure, because metal can reduce the earth. Both two and five stars belong to the earth element, and the five and four star combination is also a controlling cycle. The number four wood star controls the number five earth star, and this indicates loss of money. Or financial problems, and the third combination is two and four. It's also a controlling cycle. The number four wood star controls number two earth star, and this combination can mean relationship trouble or disharmony with your in-laws. So both north and northwest are not lucky areas in July twenty twenty one. The next direction is northeast. We have number three star as the monthly star, and the number three is a wood star. The wood generates fire. The number nine star. So this is a lucky combination. It indicates increased money luck and intelligence, or talent. And another star here is the number two. Again, the number two is a illness star. The number three wood star controls the number two earth star, and the two three combination is called the bull five combination. It indicates argument, quarrel, any legal issues, or fighting. Another combination here is nine and two. The number nine star is a fire star and generates number two. The Earth star. So this is a good combination, showing increased wealth luck, relationship luck, and intelligence. And because of the number two for the period eight star, we can add some metal feng shui cure again to reduce the power of number two illness star and try to avoid construction in the northeast. Next one is the east. We have number seven as a monthly star, and the number seven is the star of quarrel or argument or conflict. So both seven four and seven six combination are related to conflict and argument, and six and seven combination is called the sword fight combination because both are metal element. On the good side, this can bring you. Promotion, power, and status, but it can also bring you a lot of fighting, accident, or legal issues. And the number four is a wood element, and the number seven metal controls the wood. So it's all about disharmony and fighting. 
and because of the number four star is affected, it can affect the oldest daughter the most. The number four and six combination is also the metal controlling the wood. Even though this combination shows the power, talent, and intelligence, it can also bring in money loss or legal issues. Since there is a lot of metal energy and fighting energy, we can reduce the metal element here in the east. Or another way is to increase the water element. Water can reduce the metal element. So you can add any water element, such as a fountain or fish tank, or any colors of blue or black. The next section is southeast. We have number eight as the monthly star, and the number eight is the most auspicious star in the period eight right now. So this is a very good star, and the first combination is eight and five. The number five is a star of misfortune or accident. The five eight combination can bring helpful people or helpful mentor, and it also shows good luck in real estate or anything related to property. Because both five and the eight stars belong to the earth element, and the next combination is eight and seven. The number eight Earth star generates number seven metal star, and this indicate good money luck. The third combination is five and seven. The number five Earth star generates number seven metal star, so this can also mean good wealth luck. On the other hand, the number seven star is about quarrel, fighting, legal issues. And the number five is about accident, illness, or any obstacles. So here we still have to control the number five star by adding some metal objects, such as a bronze bell, wind chime, and anything made of metal. And also avoid construction in the southeast. The next section is the south. We have number four star, and our yearly star here is number one. So we see the one and four combination. That's a classic combination for intelligence, talent, and it's very good for students or anybody who need to pass exam, or even just getting a promotion. And this is also a great place for study, or as a home office or a library. And the number three star is similar to number seven star. It's about quarrel, fighting, and possible legal issues. So the three and four combination can bring relationship trouble or disharmony in your relationship. And the number one and number three combination is the water generates wood. This usually means fame or promotion. But on the other hand, because of the number three star. It can also means quarrel, fighting, or some money loss. So for the south area, basically it's about intelligence and fame, but also relationship issues and disharmony. Next area is the southwest. We have number six, the metal star, and the metal controls the wood, the number three star. So this is the controlling cycle. The three six combination can bring accident or legal trouble, and it tends to affect the oldest son. So it's better for the oldest son to travel during this time. The next combination is six and five. The number five star generates number six metal star. So this means increased wealth luck and also fame. And the number three wood star controls the number five earth star, and the three five combination can mean illness, robbery, or any obstacles. So because of the number five star, we still have to pay attention to any possible accident and health issues. So place the metal feng shui cure again here. 
to reduce the number phi Earth star and avoid construction here. So that's our July 2021 flying star combination chart analysis. And here is a summary chart. The best area is the center again, just like the last month. I know the information can be confusing because it sounds like they are conflicting with each other. So you just have to adapt to your situation. Depends on your most important rooms, such as your bedroom or the location of your main entrance, that will probably affect you the most. And if you are worried about health issues, you should pay attention to the number two and number five stars and place metal feng shui cures. Also avoid constructions in those areas. I will put the chart on our blog at picturehealer.com for your reference. Thank you so much for watching and supporting this channel. I will talk to you next week.